The champ looks ready for this match here tonight. It's hard to think of a champion who always has that look of determination. The title might not be on the line here tonight. This still has that same big fight feel. You stole my line, Byron, but I'll allow it for 2K. Nonetheless, you're right, the champ. Off the top. Oh, Tiny arm drag. I like yours better, Cole. Quick reflex is so important in a match like this. Sherman! Just pure dominance. Just reverberated throughout the entire building. Talk about making a statement. DDT. Any one of these attacks could cause irreparable damage, but I don't think you can come back from this many. Coming in on the arm. A lot of momentum now on his side. He is just dumb. Off the top. Diving arm drag. Beautiful. And just like that, we've kicked the tempo up a notch. Kick to the body of the Shining Wizard! From the top! He saw that one coming. Oof. And a spy buster! Oh, what a kick! Oh, look at this power! This is unholy! Look at that! Considered Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. Still in it. What a gutsy performance. Oh, incredible athleticism. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Sword. Have to wait to get out of hand there. Reversals, reversals, and more reversals. A running Hong Kong. Does he have him here? And he kicks out of the pen and one. All the punishment he's taken, and yet he's still in this match. DDT, and now he's on the down. Look at this fire, and the rope forces the break. Great effort there. Cunning swanton, awesome. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. Was playing with fire and getting burned. The decision to take such a risk at this juncture is questionable. Ah. Oh my, what a splash! For the victory here! Ah. And an effective pin. This deep into the match, and he's able to kick out before a one count? It's stunning! The end is looming now! There is no way this can go on for much longer. Backstabber. Top rope, here we go. From the top. Twisting into a moonsault. For the win. There's two. And now we're about to do it, folks. Here is your winner, the ladies' man. So perhaps the perfect match. Never any doubt in this win. An absolute statement by the victor here tonight. What a steamrolling. The squared circle is basically the Wild West right now. You have to question what kind of malintent is behind a power bomb with that much force. Oh, Just muscling up their opponent into the gut wrench. Talk about in. 
intimidation. I'm not sure if it's resilience or stupidity that's going to drive you to try and come back from a move like that. The trap in the corner. We got a strike fest going on. Being treated like a heavy bag. Get out of there. He's got the answer for that one. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. Cross landing powerbomb. I felt the vibration of that one from all the way over here. Shot to the face gets them out of that spot. This isn't going to be pretty. Hangman's neck break. Oh, gosh. Oh, man. He delivers the leg drop. He'll head to the ring. Took him out the knee. That was showing great awareness of positioning, placing yourself between the ref and your opponent. He's absorbed some damage already. Yeah, he's taken some hits, but in a fatal four-way, you expect to get a little roughed up. for elimination here. So much for that. Guess that wasn't quite the opportune moment. Boom! Claymore delivered! A competitor has been eliminated. Oh. Here is your winner, Kenro. What a finale to this intense Fatal 4-Way match. We saw something special from each of these men tonight. I thought all four of them had a shot at winning this match. Each superstar is keeping one eye on each opponent in this triple threat match with Kane, Rey Mysterio, and Rob Van Dam. No count outs, no disqualifications, no allegiances. If there is an alliance formed during this match at some point, it becomes every superstar for themselves. Only one of the three will end up with their arm raised in a victory here tonight. He's heading back to the ring. Oh, on the apron, lifting it up into the ring. Bam, suplex. Being able to pull that off, no one is going to question if you skip going to the gym tonight. Oh, launching himself from the ropes. Boom. No disqualifications has to benefit a certain type of superstar more than others, doesn't it, Corey? Get off your high horse, Cole. And no disqualification match benefits the superstar who's smarter, faster, and better. Using the rules to your advantage doesn't make you the villain here. The biggest little man in WWE history is standing tall. Now he's been put on the defensive. He needs to be careful. You don't want to be the weak link in a triple threat. The top is Kane looking at him this quickly. Only getting one out of that pin. Definitely looks in a hurry to finish things. Hooked up. DDT. Oh, yeah. Mysterio is feeling it. Oh, God. And misses on the springboard. Coming back in the ring. Big ball. Oh, what a kick to the face. Oh, this is just disrespectful. 
And an elbow drop for added measure. Spiked. Into the pin attack. He's nowhere near ready to stop fighting yet. Oh, what a diddy team. Wow. What a leg drop. And now he rolls out looking for a timeout. We don't get any timeouts in a fight. Let's just run on the way. Taking flight. What? And after that, you know things have just kicked up a notch. Pedal with a medal right now. Ruthless chop block. Watch out. They're coming towards the announce desk. What the hell are you doing, Byron? Oh, Rey Mysterio now. Oh, look out. <laughs> Number one. Here comes the second. And around and out for the third. Three Amigo style by Rey Mysterio. He's back into the ring. He's in a little bit of trouble now. This should come as no surprise. In a havoc filled triple throw, you're going to take some big hits. Submission. Around the world and back again. Hurricane Rana. I got vertigo after watching that. Drop kick finds the spot. Taking out the knee. I'll tell you this, guys. No competitor here is looking to give in. It's going to take a lot to end this fight. We are just seeing sheer perseverance. Nothing is being left back. This is going to come down to who wins it. And that was an expertly executed DDT. on the face of Kane. Into the DDT! Oh, round and round we go! Tilt the world head scissors! It'll mess up the back of your neck! Here he goes for the win! Then he closes it out! Barely kicks out! How in the world did he kick out? Drop of the leg. Heading up, he's thinking big. Perched up top. No telling what's underneath the ring time. The universal signal for extreme. The kendo stick has entered the foot. Caught square by the haymaker. Way. Dangerous Hurricane Lana. That attack looks 
Looks to have stifled Kane. After lasting this long in a triple threat, it'd be a shame to take a nosedive now. Right, he's got him here. He's got him over. And back into the ring. That was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. And there was some force on that move. Kane prevents the attack from collecting. Short line. He could pin his opponent right here. It's over. And there's the breakup. Just in the nick of time. Dodge right on cue. to the outside now. Taking this to the floor. A kendo stick wrapped around the head. Hope you boys put your running shoes on. It might be time to clear out. He climbs into the ring. Destruction.
And here we have a superstar with a big chip on his shoulder. He has certainly felt overworked recently. Well, he has a chance to change that perception in this matchup. And he's taking on someone who acts like he has nothing to lose. I don't care who you are, taking on an opponent with that mindset is always dangerous. Ooh, what a damaging blow. Look at this, just unloading. And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. The fight is being brought right to him. He's going to have to dig out of this in a hurry. Stomping down. Oh, targeting the stomach. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. If he can hold the line here, he'll be in a good position. This just unloading and a Oof. stop to the gut too. And he's keeping the pressure on. It's a sign he's got his opponent figured out. Lift off. Splash. And up the turnbuckles we go. Take off. Oh, flattening the opposition. Consecutive high risk maneuvers and the pace of this match has certainly picked up. Never a doubt, barely a moment's suspense. This one was about as lopsided as they come. The cerebral assassin Triple H has his crosshair squarely on his opponent. While Triple H loves to get inside the head of his opponent, his mat technique is near perfection. Being a student of the art makes Triple H even more dangerous. He always seems to be one step ahead of his opponents. And we know that he's not against taking a shortcut to get to that step either. And on the other side is Randy Orton, the third generation superstar who has pure wrestling ability and championship pedigree pumping through his veins. Randy Orton was absolutely born for victory in the WWE ring. Oh no. Foot right to the belly. Look at this, just unloading. Oh, a nasty stomp to finish it off. Up high. Oh. Corey Triple H is, of course, known as the cerebral assassin. Is it wise to try to outwit a competitor like him? The competition shouldn't so much as try to outwit or outplay the game, but instead just be patient. Don't try to come for the king and possibly miss. Let the king come to you and take your moment. The damage he's taken is starting to pile up. Yeah, but he's not breathing heavy yet. And now after that, look at the story painted red on Triple H's face. Up high! Oh. From way up. Look down the way that can change the whole complexion of this match. Inverted vertical suplex. Can he do it here? Raising the arm before one. Maybe that was just to keep his opponent off balance. Made, but we know the Viper is adept at remaining on the offensive. 
And a Oof. stop to the gut, too. Oh, no. Oh, a stop right to the gut. Boom. Just mounted with punches and not producing a trampoline. He's going for it all. Launching. Look out for Showing absolutely no apprehension to putting one's body on the line. He steps foot in the ring again. Up high. All the way to the outside. Just crashing down with high impact. Just like that, his patience against Triple H has been rewarded. He's absolutely taking his moment right now. The game's starting to look beaten here. These are dire straits for him. He needs to be extra cautious now. The Vipers lined up his prey. We know what's next. Able to give him the slip. seen guys as always Cole you're more polite than I am so I'll just say what we're all thinking this was as one-sided as it gets Shawn Michaels is fed up with the disrespect he's receiving from younger members of the WWE locker room. There was a time in HBK's career where he was brash and not on many people's Christmas card list, but he didn't care then what people thought, and he shouldn't care now either. Either way, Michaels is looking to straighten things out right now. Well, let's hope he's ready to face off against the one and only Edge. I don't know if anyone can be ready for Edge, Saxton. He's one of the most adaptable superstars WWE has ever known. Edge has the ring presence and chops. Few people will ever come close to obtaining. Disheartening position for HBK. And Edge is carefully calculating every movement. Or it has to be quite daunting knowing you're going into a match against a legend like Edge. Can his opponent overcome that mental hurdle here? It's not going to be easy, Cole. A lot of Edge's career was built on mind games. If you're worried about facing off against him before, from the top, splash! He's able to sidestep there. Pile driver spiked him. As much grit as it takes to hit a pile driver, we cannot forget how much fighting spirit it takes to keep going after taking one. Will we see that spirit to fight back? Oh, face first. And that move has HBK looking a little wobbly. Yeah, his edge was at the right place at the right time there, and he took advantage. Look out! Splash! Sizing his opponent up! Here he comes! He's there! Edge can put it away here. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Incoming! Lions the splash! That's gotta be it! Two and a half in the waning moments of this match. Edge 
makes the climb up the turnbuckles. Sky high through the air and connects. You want to talk about putting it all on the line. Always an extra risk when you dive ringside. Flying. Good lord. Taking flight. It doesn't matter if you're on the outside of the ring. There is no place safe when you face such a risk taker. Suspense. This one was about as lopsided as they come. WWE superstars live on the edge every time they step in the ring, but in a no disqualification match, they find themselves even closer to that edge. You're right, Corey. Anything goes here, so these superstars have to be ready to play defense against any weapons the opposition might use. If history is any guide, this match will just get more chaotic and brutal as the minutes go by. The superstars feel each other out a bit, weather some storms, and then do everything in their power to get the pinfall or submission. Ah, oh, striking with an A. What kind of headspace do you need to be successful in a no disqualification match? A ruthless one, Cole. You can't show any remorse about going after your opponent full force. Anytime you waste second guessing yourself, it's time for your opponent to get their hands on you. Some of his win now. In triple threat, the damage comes from the top. Twisted Bliss finds the mark. He'll take things into the ring. Oh, oh, oh. Gosh. He went right into that turnbuckle. Oh, trampling the opposition.
My goodness, look at this. Oh, he's got 11 arms and feet. And now he's giving you all another chance to simply take it all in. Kick to the body and a shining wizard. He's begging him to get up so he can put him back down. Triple Threat Match. Here is your winner, Cowboy. Tremendous victory in this Triple Threat Match. I cannot even imagine how any of these men feel after a match like that. All I can really say is that they put on a Triple Threat Match for the ages.